Hey, welcome back to your Caribou Data Science Channel America. A big shout out to the five people who watched this video yesterday. I appreciate every single one of you. But here's the thing. Five views should be should equal five likes. So I need you to step up to the plate, view the videos, click the subscribe button, watch the video, click the share button, and click the like button. Okay? Share this video today on your Facebook and your Twitter accounts. Okay? Let's get started. And of course, the news out of California is going to, California is going to change the way they uh, count cases or what they're going to count as a case, which will probably which will probably result in a, an artificial increase in cases all of a sudden. Uh, that's according to the New York Times. You can see currently the U.S. has 34.6 million cases. Let's just come back here. Okay. Okay, with 34.67 million cases in the U.S. since uh, January 1st of 2020, uh, 607,801 since January 1st, 2020. Uh, here's here, I need to work on this plot a little bit. Anyway, here's the numbers for 2020. Notice the trend. Now look at the numbers for 2021. You had this huge, massive trend, but now we are seeing a trend back up here in cases. But hopefully this is this is this is just a, a bump like this over here, okay? We still had this long declining trend in cases. We have the same thing. Look look at deaths. Deaths are going the exact opposite of deaths back in 2020. Okay. Now this is the 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 uh, daily cases. You can see we are seeing a spike up in cases over here. Eleven thousand what one hundred eighteen thousand nine seventy nine cases. For, eight, for for the 28th, July 20th, that number dropped back down to 68,771 cases. For the seven-day period ending July 21st, we had, what, 504,000, no, cases reported in the U.S. on average. Yes, here's the good news. You're continuing to see, as, although it does appear maybe a slight creep up here, but nonetheless, for December 28th, we reported, U.S. reported 387 deaths. For the seven-day period ending July the 21st, we were averaging 272 deaths per day, all right? So let's take a look here at the weekly cases. We are seeing, you know, one, two, three, three, four-week increase in cases here. Maybe this one here is the beginning of a new downward trend, deaths. Well, this is 5,000 deaths. This is 2,500 deaths per week. So right now, the, the U.S. is between say, maybe three and uh, three and 4,000 deaths per week. Okay, but still, look look where we've come. We don't want to overlook this decline pattern. Okay. Look look, look how low these numbers have been since February this year. The cases have been since February this year. Okay. But look at deaths. One, two, three, four, five. The U.S. has now had six straight months in a row of, a, of declining COVID-19 deaths. And that's the number I want you to focus on. Rather concerned about cases and hospital beds, focus on the, da the, the daily, the weekly, and the monthly death numbers. Those are the numbers that really matter, okay? What this here, well, this here is, is a, it tells us how many people per 100,000 currently have uh, COVID-19 in America. Well, this is this is roughly so it's roughly 25 people per 100,000 have COVID-19. What about deaths? Well, this is a half a person. This is a quarter person. So right now, somewhere between you know one third and you know let's just let's just round it up. Right now, for every 100,000 people, one fourth of a person is dying from COVID-19. Now these are the these are the cumulative totals. And what we're looking for is a flattening of the curve. Okay. Well, we're seeing a slight flattening. Well, it's not crazy flattening, okay? 
seeing some flattening here also. We really want to see this flattening period continue on over here. And we want to see this flatten back out and continue on this way also. So anyway, uh, America, the best news I have for you today is that, uh, well, in actual fact, um, um, in actual fact, uh, deaths are continuing their downward trend. Okay. Anyway, thanks so much for your time, America. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Don't forget to click the like button. Hey, and for you 11 people out there, remember, 11 views equal 11 likes and 11 subscriptions. So don't forget to subscribe to the Caribbean Data Science channel today. Thanks so much, America. We'll catch you tomorrow to the update report.